Inner Earth grapes are huge, much bigger than these ones here in Germany. And I will tell you that actually they're so big that they'd be as big as my fist. So after traveling out of body and seeing that place, I want to travel there physically. Now I know that in Toronto there was a underground tunnel that went there. And there's actually a map that you can see online that shows the many different places. Now what I learned is that the way we interpret what's going on depends on our uh, how, how getting down there is dependent upon that because of uh, just like quantum physics if you're looking at something and it strikes fear within you it can be harmful to you but if it doesn't you can literally take nuclear radiation and it does not harm your body I know this because of uh, as I've been just eating fruit now my body's been cleansing out and I realize that if I uh, am, am at peace when I'm eating this I everything seems to my energy levels are up but if something caused me to be um, fearful, maybe like, uh, oh man, I'm going to die if I just eat fruit and I don't eat any protein or, or, or any of the, whatever the other people say, it could have a negative effect upon me. But it doesn't. Because of I realize that just like Adam, my body is created to uh, partake of the uh, fruit and herbs that God created uh, for us to partake of. And mainly the ones inside the earth. I know that I... Uh, we'll be eating of the tree of life. Actually, the tree of life is goes up and down our spinal cord. That's something else that you could study if you want to uh, relearn what that is. Because there's a lot of things in the Bible that I realize point to, to greater things. Now that I've been detoxifying and I realize that I even have a part in my frontal lobe here that allows me to access the things of the Spirit, see in the world, and not only that, but now I communicate with Michael... He's an angel, a light being is another word. See, there's many different words to describe the supernatural or the fifth dimension. It's the fifth dimensional world in there. Um, the fourth dimension quite often is what people see when they use their imagination. The fifth dimension, uh, when I move entirely into the fifth dimension, you will not be able to see my body with this camera unless I lower to this third dimension. Uh, it's a fifth dimensional world inside the earth. A lot of people saw a fire because of, well, it had to do with the condition of their heart, right? Two people can look at the same location and one is in heaven and one is in hell. Uh, it's a multidimensional universal truth. So, hey, I want to let you know, though, that when I, what I mean is paradise is so accessible to us right now. I want all of you to realize how we could be walking in paradise right this very moment, as soon as we connect with the creative source in us. It, it has to do with... Um, well, we are, but recognizing it, consciously making ourselves aware of we are connected with the Creator. We are connected in the Spirit. We are connected. And we are all in one purpose, and that is love, life, eternal. Um, everything that you see is energy. We are all different forms of energy. Oh, you can feel bliss, and I'm going to even feel more bliss. As I eat these grapes, my energy level goes up, and I start to light up even more. I biked up a mountain, and uh, I'm not even out of breath. That's what just eating fruit will do for you. I'm really promoting this because I want maybe McDonald's and um, Bill Gates and a lot of the other people that are owning these food industries will start putting up more fruit products. Like, I mean, they already are. I see that happening, but how about McDonald's? fruit salad I'm making it sweet fruits the sweet fruit salad the, the best fruits for you are the are the ones that um, are not sour but are sweet mm, and juicy fresh and whole love you all